our children are not only our future but they are the future of the world how much do we care about what kind of people they are becoming are they growing up into loving and kind people or are they growing up into heartless people every one of you who is listening to me you could be a parent a grandparent a teacher an uncle or aunt take a moment to think of children who are a part of your life how are you taking part in architecting the being of the children around you today's education is not an inside out education it is not addressing the being of the child actually it is an overload of information on the intellect unfortunately without nurturing the heart without nurturing the heart of the child with beautiful states of love kindness gratitude appreciation compassion how do we create beautiful people out of them only such children with an awakened heart can grow into peaceful individuals and peaceful leaders let us begin with two things one not to do and one to do do not let differences grow within them as religious differences racial differences caste class differences because these poisonous weeds of differences and division ultimately kills their heart and do focus on nurturing an awareness of interconnection between them and nature let every child be made conscious of how interconnected they are with the world with how interconnected they are with every tree with how their breath is inseparable from the breath of the tree outside the windows of the classroom let every child be educated into an awareness into an observation of their own emotions let us understand that anger is a part of our consciousness fear is a part of our consciousness desire to dominate is a part of our consciousness but a child needs to know how to become free of anger or free of fear or free of desire to dominate and hurt someone when it arises within them every child should know that love is a part of our consciousness joy and bliss are part of our consciousness peace and harmony are part of our consciousness so every child needs to be awakened to these states experientially every child must be taught how to become conscious of themselves every child must become conscious of their inner state every child must become conscious of their actions every child must become conscious of the impact of their state every child must become conscious about who they are becoming fundamentally as a human being this brush with truth this self awareness has a phenomenal impact i believe that every child should be taught very simple meditations with which they can end their inner violence and nurture more gratitude and love in their hearts